Hello guys and welcome back to a brand new Drafty Josh video. In today's video guys, we are going to be focusing on invasion and nothing else guys. I want to look... Oh, that's a good deal. That is a good deal. I'm actually quite tempted to grab that one. There we go. That's tasty. That is tasty, guys. Now I look at that, I don't need a lot more. I can get Ursula upgraded a few more times. Because to be fair, Ursula's actually a really good character, guys. Um, my friend Rob uses Ursula quite a lot. And I've seen her potential. She is a very good character. Look at that, I need two to level up as well. Nice. So I definitely need to make sure I jump in the heists and get those achievements done every day. But I think I've already done the heist one today. Yeah, I have. Cool. Let's quickly get these done and then I'm going to jump into the invasion. Got 880 in the surge. That's naughty. Hundred thousand. I reckon, I reckon, I reckon they can do that. Come on, boys. Oh, that was so close. Zerg nearly got his special out then. Nice. Can City Watch. Hit the normal raid. Oh, I need to make sure that I reset it like that. Lovely. Just so that I can carry over. Check into the guild. This is a cool perfect in the market. You know the normal drill guys. Now let's spend some time focusing Ooh, I can get Genie five stars tomorrow as well. Mickey Mouse is one. Cool. Now guys. Let's spend some time focusing up on the invasion because this mode recently just came back in, and obviously they've also allowed um, they've they've rewarded everybody. They've finally given people the rewards. So yeah, I'm intrigued to see how this one plays out, and now I've got a better understanding of how invasion works and how you're meant to use it and how you're meant to play with it. Because before I didn't use any of my power ups because I thought there wasn't any point. Oh, I think, did they just get glitched and all die then? I don't know. Oh, you, wait. That turns it on and it uses it. You might as well just, because I can use that for 17 battles, guys. So you might as well just have it on for all of them because when the event's over, nothing carries over. So a lot of you are asking me that these power-ups and these perks we have, do they carry over? They do not, guys. So every game, just drop these power-ups on. I think you can use one. But you can use more than one. Just use them, because there's, there's no reason not to. So everyone's got a shield now. Oh my god. The resistance on Judy then was insane. So guys, comment down below what you guys are thinking of um, invasion mode. I want to know. I want to know what you think. Reduce their max HP by thirty percent. That's ridiculous. Because you, you just want to get through these as quickly as possible, really. So you just use all the power ups.
Like that, see? Everybody's just dropping. Oh, I can, so, power up all blue. Because I'm only doing the cats I use to so do all blues again. No, Anna? There you go, so that's just tickled him up a little bit. And I don't use Scarf in my boss battles. That's why, but I always use Moana, so I'm quite happy to get that plus five on her. Just to bring her up to that little bit better, make her a bit stronger. It's just not not even any troubles here, guys. Right, so what I do want to do is buy those again. Get my free revives. Then I can go and power up my heroes again. So I've got six, which means I can smash through loads of these. Now, I can probably do some one times damage because of how boosted my team is here. And I can boost them up one more time, so I'm going to do everybody. I'm going to do everybody again. Cool, so look at all those boosts. I've got 200,000 power, guys. So let's smash it. Let's see if I can do it on a single. So I want Shank to take some damage before I use our special. So obviously that's what makes us stronger. It's important to keep on the time as well. So now I use Shank's move. Ooh, that was close. So the next one I know I'm going to have to use the three times on. So that's dropped. So this one I'm going to use the three times on. And power up again. And smash it all to the blue enemies again. Doing Calhoun. Zerg and Shank each time I power up. So I'm going to do it the same. I'm not going to go straight in with specials. But with the free time power, guys, obviously, insane, insane amount of damage. But obviously, because I wasn't able to, I was just about able to do the other one with single, you might as well smash that with a free. So now I could probably three times that one, but to do that, Put my bits in it. Cool, I'm gonna need to go into here, do a couple more of these battles, and once again, I'll use the energy regain. So I'm gonna do the same thing here. Do that. There we go. Just because those are the guys which I've beasted up, which should make life easier and get through everything a bit quicker. So then you can obviously start to swap characters out depending on who you're leveling and who you're using. So I've got one more, so now I can go back into the boss battle, go into this one, do another times three, do another power up. Put on Calhoun, get her to 31, smash through, and now I'm on times three again. So we'll, I won't use all, I'll wait until Sully gets his move up to, so I can open up the crits first. that killed him. So I might as well attack everybody else with times three or times five damage or whatever it does because I know it will clear everybody straight away. So now I'd go back into here. Cripple energy regain fight. That drain is just ridiculous. Might as well just keep using that. Of course, Moana saves up for a few blows, she always does.
There is a bit of a glitch, guys, that sometimes you can skip two battles, as if you quickly tap onto the next one, everybody's immediately KO'd. It's not really that useful of a tip, because you don't get any rewards for skipping past them, but... So now I've got three more, so I'm going to push into my 65 and do the exact same thing here. Once again, guys, that's not an advert for me, it's the screen recorder I'm using. Look at that, I'm still able to rinse, I still have 36 seconds left on that one. Which is good, because that leads me to believe that I'm going to be able to... So if I go into the shop, I can buy four more power-ups, so I can smash them on my character. So if I go back into normal, power-up five times now, put everyone on shank. Power everybody up. Power everybody up. Everybody. Shank. So Shank's on 40 now, so I'm going to keep fighting through. And obviously each time you're able to power up the characters that you're using, it makes the game a lot easier. I didn't even need to, you don't really need to use any power-ups guys. Like I said, I just do it to make it quicker, because you want to do speed here. That was just ridiculously easy. Whatever, just use everything. Let's make my life easy. So look how easy that was to kill everyone. Keep pushing. So ideally, guys, you want to start off being selfish and just killing the guys that you find, because then you can build your power up and let loose on everybody else, like without even thinking about it. So at the moment, just cow. Um, See, I did that, skipped, and got through the next one straight away. Got my boy Sully up one as well. Look at that. So far, again, let's see if I can do my skip technique again, because it worked that last time. So it's all about just flying through these as quickly as possible. Oh my god, Calhoun's move now. Rinses. It's actually quite mental, guys. Like, I'm quite enjoying this mode. I kind of take back the bad things I was saying about it. So let's go again. Everyone's just dropping. So now I'm going to do a few more boss battles. So I've got 13. So that was found by me. I'll do a times three for my main characters and fight. I wish you could bring in those little perks over into all the boss fights as well, but. You want to use, like, try and use the moves when Sully's got his roar up, because then you can activate crits. So we'll go again here. So I'm going to try and wait until Sully's got his roar up to use everybody's special.
So then you do ultimate crits, open them up again. Also, you've got to remember that Woody, um, Sully does all the healing as well for me. There's that one done as well. I reckon I can do that one as well. Got another power up. Smash it onto everyone. Fight through. Let's get the same technique. Let's wait for Sully to just get his move up quickly. But this guy does start to do insane amounts of damage to me. Well, I must have got a crit in them or something because he just dropped. Boost everyone up again. You can just smash it just to heal him up. Cool, and I'll fight again. This will be the last one I'll do for this video, guys, because I don't want to bore you to death with invasion. But I'm quite enjoying this new mode, so I want to prioritize the videos I do for the next week. Just a little bit on invasion mode, guys. Because um, obviously it's, it's only out, it's not out for long invasion. But Shank is very good on invasion. Because the boss does so much damage. Yes, yeah, so to be honest, I'm quite happy with the results in that. Um, I do need to use my energy. Who was I upgrading? Who was I messing around with now? Ah, I was doing Eve, wasn't I? I was going to do Eve. To try and get Shank's friendship mission sorted out. Oh, I need to do one more. See, that just allows me to get Eve that little bit better, guys. And I'll spend a little bit of time tomorrow putting more on her skills. See if I can finish her friendship mission off. I'll probably have to put a few more on her skills before I go to bed as well, guys. Um, and I'm making her fly through the levels. Cool. Sally's well, but I, she's kind of got stuck on that level. Nearly get Jack to four stars. If I get the chapter 15, I can craft that one now, which is nice. Um, I'm just using the rest of my energy on this. Nice. So, anyway, guys, as always, hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, guys, smash that like button, smash the subscribe button, do it in honour of Chris Pratt. I'll see you all in the next one, guys. Stay safe. I'll see you soon.